YouTube, Rocky here again. Another CDI video. So, we're going to try lemmings this time. See what this is like. Ah, uh, there's two companies you miss. Signosis and DMA Design. So, this is a unique intro. Never seen this before anyway, so let's have a quick watch. that weird sort of same graphical style as the uh, Zelda cutscenes are. I'm not really sure this is necessary, but... Lemmings. Uh, I'm not sure if that intro was really necessary. It looks like something that was knocked up in deluxe paint on the Amiga. In fact, that really wouldn't surprise me if that's how it was done. So, standard screen. You notice there's no music on the intro screen, which is very weird. So, let's play it. I'm using again the uh, controller. I suppose you would call it a controller. So, Lemmings. It looks very much like the Amiga version. I wouldn't surprise me if that's where it's ported from, but probably is. So maybe check that. But. One thing I have noticed of playing a few levels is when the lemmings go into the escape tunnel thing, generally if you'd up to speed, the boing 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 noise would go faster. It doesn't matter what rate they enter, the boing boing noise is always the same. So. And there. Notes. Still using codes, which is kind of strange considering the CDI has a built in save feature, but. It's, as I said, it's probably just a port, so... Do 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 do, let me... Okay. Let's go! The CDI 
guy does have a mouse apparently, so um, to play with a mouse, but this thing actually works not too bad. Not any problems with it so far anyway. And there we go. Guys, that was um, Lemmings on the CDI. It's Lemmings, it's not all I can say, it's, it's Lemmings. It's obviously a port of one of the 16-bit game, 16-bit uh, machines. Thanks for tuning in, guys. I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.